Hey, my name is Kendall Matthews, and in this video, we're going to show you how workflow automation software works for customer support and ticket processing tasks. If you want to see more videos like this, make sure to hit the thumbs up button and subscribe. Diego, let's give them the walkthrough, but show them using the Teragrobots feature on the Electronic RPA platform, integrating Zendesk, OpenAI, Gmail, and a CSV file. So now um, we have our last um, bot example, which is uh, for customer support. So we are talking about a bot that will um, create tickets based on emails that we receive in a mailbox. Okay. So in this case, we are using not only the new uh, the the Gmail uh, activity. We are using also uh, OpenAI, and we are using. Sendesk to create this um, ticket or issue in the, um, in the Sendex application. So you can see that we have here the Sendex application. There is no new ticket already created. This is uh, obviously um, the demo uh, environment. It's not production. Uh, so now we'll work on this um, on this workflow. So first of all, same as before, we are starting this with. Um, reading emails, which the subject is support request, and um, it is marked as unread. Okay, what we'll do with this information? We'll send to ASCII with a new prompt, with a new question. In this case, we are telling them to act as super agent. Uh, you are reviewing emails and opening new tickets in Sendex with the content of those emails. You receive an email from, we are putting here the uh, sender of the email that we have received, obviously taking the information from this previous activity that we have tested uh, with the subject, the subject of that email and the following body. We are putting here the content of that email. So we are uh, asking EI to do that. Based on this information, determine the nature of the problem and return ticket content, the subject, title describing the issue. This is what we are setting up in our send ticket. The body, short paragraph explaining what the issue is and the expected solution. So we are not just getting this information and inserting into self into Sendex. We are asking uh, GPT to interpret, to analyze the information and provide a better explanation. And also the expected result or resolution. Then we are again being clear what we need from it. So return it in comma separated format as in this example. First the subject, then the body. These are the two uh, um, pieces of data that we need to create an issue in Sendesk. Okay. So we are also using this auxiliary activity to separate those, those values so we can point to those values very easy when using this connection to the Sendesk. Um, here we have the Sendex activity. We have selected the actions to create an issue. We have here the connection. In this case, you can do the connection with using single sign-on, very easy. Then we are informing which is the subject or the issue subject for the ticket and the comment. Okay, this is the result of our OpenAI. Okay, and this will create the ticket. So let's test this. Let's uh, load first the data. Let me show you the email that we are using to work with this one, which is support request. Okay. We can see over here that we, this, uh, this is an email that is uh, asking the support team help on resetting my Active Directory password. My user is iRamos. Please, this is Ocean. Okay. So basically, the bot will be uh, reading this this um, this email, analyzing the information, and creating the ticket in the send desk that we have over that. Good. So let's first load the data from the inbox. Good, we have the data already loaded. Okay, so then we will ask GPT. We can test this one also and see the answer that we have. We'll receive a text with all the information that uh, is being analyzed with the result of first the subject for the ticket. And then we can see here after the comma, the content for the ticket. Okay, so then we can here Split it in order to select 
uh, the, the information, you can see that we have two separate lines with the subject and with the description. And now we can create the ticket when we test this step. Okay, so let's test it. Okay, it was successful. It's saying that it was created. We don't need to uh, analyze this information. This is how is the answer that is coming from the integration with Sendesk. So let's check now. Here, let's refresh over here if we have a new ticket. It's coming here. Good. We have an unassigned ticket. You can see that it was created less than a minute ago with the information that extracted from the email. If we open the ticket, we can see Active Directory Password Reset Request for User Iramos. Very clear that what we need to do. And then the description. Ivan Ramos, information about him, has requested origin assistant with resetting his Active Directory password. His username is Iramos. He expects support team to guide him through the password reset process or perform the reset on his behalf. Okay, so I think that is very clear, more elaborated than what we received in the original email. Absolutely very clear, Diego. And folks, if you want to learn more about the Integrabots feature, the Electronic AI RPA platform has options from the free community edition to the enterprise cloud plans. Now is the time to reshape how your business approaches customer support and ticket processing. So go ahead and share this video with a business friend and let's intelligently automate your business.